This video was brought to you by Colorshield.net. Hey guys, it's Apple Tech coming at you guys with a review on the Brixen Color Shield for your iPhone 4 or 4S. So this is how the package looks. I already opened it and this was sent out for review. So let me just take it out and as you guys can see right there, that is how the Brixen Shield comes. There is nothing else in the package but this. And on the top, you can see that it comes in pearl white. They do have a white and a green and many other different colors. So you can go check them out at colorshield.net. Now towards the top you get color shield and then it has a HD anti glare protection film for your front and back of your iPhone if you guys take a look. For the bottom it says Apple iPhone 4 but it should work on the 4S as well. Towards the bottom you just get more features and then you have the logo of the Brixen. If we turn it around you can see that it gives you a lot of things, an overview, some features, um, what comes in the package so I'll be going over that when I open it. Down here it says, for more information, please visit colorshield.net. So if you're on the USA, you want to go to colorshield.net. But if you're outside of the USA, you want to visit www.brixen.com. So that's just a good hint if you guys want to go purchase this and want to know the URL of the website. So now that I have opened it, folks, let's see what comes in the Brixen package. There is nothing else in there if you guys take a look. So you do have this paper which you open and I believe all the stuff is in here. Now this is just a carrying case and it gives you the logo of the Brixen and how to install it. So if you guys are interested and want to do it perfectly, make sure to follow this instruction. But in this video, I will be installing this on my iPhone 4 so you guys can take a visual look of how this is installed. Now there are a couple more things that come in the package which includes the bricks and color shield for your front and back of your iPhone 4. Now the other things is you get a cleaning sticker, you get a microfiber cleaning cloth, you get alignment stickers which are in yellow right there and you do get a squeegee of tidying in there as you guys can see. So now folks I'm going to put this bricks and shield on my iPhone 4. So folks, as you guys saw there, that is how you install the Brixen Color Shield on your iPhone 4 or 4S. So now let's just go over some alignments on the top. You got a nice cutout or alignment with your FaceTime, your proximity sensor, and your little speaker grill. Down here you have your home button, which is very nice to align. If we flip to the back, you got a nice cutout for your Apple logo. And as I said, there is a paper or a plastic, my fault, a plastic on the top. So you won't have any smudges on your Apple logo, which is very nice. 
up here you have a nice cutout for your camera and your flash and there are no flash issues um, with this down here you get the bricks and logo which looks fairly nice it doesn't cover up all the iPhone now what I do got to say about the bricks and color shield is it looks very professional and you are the person who puts it on it is an easy process as you guys saw um, in the installation all you have to do is simply wipe out all the dust particles and just align it like if you're aligning a sticker um, to a paper now a plus that this bricks and shield does have is it has a matte finish so there will be no fingerprints as you guys can see if I smudge away there is no fingerprints and that is just very nice because on the regular iPhone there is glass so you do see a lot of fingerprints but with this bricks and color shield there will be nothing like that now there is a con to this case um, which comes with every product and I do have to point it out is when you take a closer look at your screen um, the image or the retina display does not pop out um, intensely um, you do not get any problems when you're swiping it, it still um, works perfectly but the images are not as crisp and they just um, don't really pop out with this brick and shield but it's not a deal breaker but it might concern you um, if you're the kind of person that really likes the iPhone for um, the resolution or anything like that but other than that I really like it um, that may be a problem to others now one more thing that really bugged me is when they sent this out for review as you guys can see right here this is what the package includes a set of the bricks and color shield you get a silicone squeegee microfiber cleaning cloth two cleaning stickers four adhesive alignment liners but it did not come with the one button film as you guys can see I do not have that white button and it did not come in the package so I don't know if that's just for my review it didn't come with it but I've been seeing other reviews and they did include the button um, that's the only down part that I don't um, get but when you purchase this it should include the button but for some reason it did not come in my package so that is kind of like a bummer but that that shouldn't be a problem to you that's probably just a problem for me but other than that my ratings for this bricks and color shield would have to be a 9 out of 10 just because of the image it does um, make your retina display kind of um, dull and not as crisp as the original one but other than that the bricks and shield is very nice because it does give your device kind of like a white iPhone look and it is the cheapest way um, to get your iPhone to look white because I do have a black iPhone so for those of you guys that do want a white iPhone this is a great and cheap way to get it so folks that is much it for my review on the Brickson color shield like always if you guys like this video just make sure to rate it a thumbs up make sure to favorite the video right down there subscribe up top for more cool videos like this this is Apple Tech Thanks for watching.